Big Eye, Big Eye McNisolich joins us, all whites legend and a stalwart of the Auckland City Club. Four trophies in a single year. What a success. I mean, it's been incredible, mate. Yeah, look, incredible season. Um, you know, really happy for the players, for the staff, for the for the club. It's it's a club that strives to to win uh, uh, trophies and, and, and awards and and do the best that they can possibly do. And for us to go through this season and to collect uh, uh, four trophies for everything that we've entered into is is absolutely incredible. And uh, yeah, look, a lot of hard work has gone on. We talked about it within the group. I think we, we, we've been training or having game match days for about 300 days, uh, past 300 days, so um, we're out of the past year, sorry, season, so it's been a long time to get a lot of hard work on it, and you know, those finer details and that hard work has, has managed to pay off for us, so we're really, really happy here. Yeah. Ivan, when you say that you're a training day, oh, sorry, training match days, do you, what do you mean? Do you, do you train like it's a match day? No, I just mean all together, 300 days together, uh, either it's a training day or a match day, you know, so it's quite an intense season, the longest, I believe, uh, 42 games in 35 weeks, so a lot of midweek games in there, so incredible effort from the players to keep, uh, you know, keep ticking over and keep keep climbing that, that sort of mountain, you know, every, every time you're coming up against a new sort of competition that started, You've got to climb that mountain, and they've done it, uh, you know, four times this year, which has been incredible. So, you know, really happy with how it's gone. Ivan Vesalich, her All Whites legend, uh, Auckland City in his veins. How do you keep the players motivated? How do you, you know, how do you keep them reaching up and wanting more and more and more? Is that a difficult thing to do? Does it come from internal? Do you, as a coaching group, have to inspire? How does this work? Yeah, I think it is difficult. It is a number of factors that happens. I mean, Coach Alberia has done really well this year, um, you know, getting the guys up for, for every game. And internally, the players need to have that fire from within. I mean, you can, many play, many people say you can have all the talent in the world, but if you haven't got the hard work and the drive, then, you know, it doesn't add up. So, yeah, we've got a good group of players that have managed to, to really push through in the, in the longest season, I think, sort of, and, and, and potential history in New Zealand has has been a bit of an eye opener for us because last year it was interrupted by COVID, so this year it was uh, it was really full on. But you know the guys just you know they dug deep, and, and every time they needed to to pull it out, a good result they managed to do it. And uh, you know last the last uh, the game just gone here, the, the final, it's it sort of sums up the I guess the. You know, the sort of roller coaster of a season, the length of a season, it's absolutely mammoth game with everything that you normally want in a final goals, red cards, everything. So, not that you want red cards, sorry, but entertaining for, yeah, the, I know uh, what you mean. Yeah. for, the, for the watcher. You know? mm. yeah. Look, and also, you know, it's not, you know, I, I just love you. You talk about desire uh, because what I saw in that final, in that last 20 minutes, was I saw a side that was absolutely existing on spirit. You could tell the season had been long and everything, but the will to win that game. I mean, that's something that, as you say, it has to come from within, doesn't it? Yeah, I think it does. I think it does. I mean, you know, playing with the man down for 45 minutes after that red card very late in the first half, you know, it's, it's hard enough playing a final with, with nobody getting sent off. And yet we're facing a, a very good side. One of the Olympic coach, my really coach and staff there, you know, it's a great setup down there as well. You know, just to, to last 45 minutes without... Um, you know, without going behind and losing the game is, is absolutely incredible, and uh, and we've, we've just put that effort in, and that and that and, and in those last few minutes, we've seen players making 50 yard runs where, as you said, you know, run out empty, but the grind is there, and, and the belief is there, and the dream to to, to continue to win is there. So it's a real, um, you know, real huge effort from the guys.